it's me. Welcome to another Sunday live stream. Um, I hope you guys are all enjoying it so far. Um, and yeah, I need to go change the mic because the mic is falling off. Here. Oh, is that what it was? Yeah, that's what I was sending you. Picture. Oh, I did wonder what that clunk was. Cole's kind of disappeared behind the piano. Oh, oh, I kind of realise I'm a little bit quiet. Um, there's still something wrong with the kind of audio thing that I'm using. Uh, one of the channels is very quiet. And I've kind of said it to me because then that way it's easier to manage. You don't want to hear me. Um, is everything back up? Yeah, so it stays that way. Yeah, I just want to point out this is the first time you have set up the mic yourself. And that's, what it's and that's the time when it fell down. Uh, but, well. uh, how was that? Fine. All good? Sorry, I'm just looking I at my assume mic it again. It's all good. Uh, at least I hope it sounds all good. I mean, because the mic is down there, maybe it might have peaked a bit sometimes, but. Yeah, no, it's not, it's actually, I think it's not nice. And hopefully... I didn't know if you noticed at all. So I was going to send you a picture and send it to you. And then. Oh, was that what. When I was looking at the screen and you were doing stuff on your right hand. I don't hand know if you could hand. have seen it or not, but evidently you didn't. And that's because my phone's sitting there. But anyway, that was very good. Um, next time, that lasted about 20 minutes. Next time, I'm going to make it last for an hour. And <laughs> then I can walk out and eat whilst you're playing. Um, but no, we did that before on um, Facebook and it went crazy. Do you remember? Like a, the very first time, first few times, it was like a thousand requests a second until I found a way of kind of um, turning it down. But uh, no, it's good. Obviously, the green screen is back. Yes. Um, it's not quite as big as the old one. So um, the good thing is it can be pulled down. Whereas last time it was fully up and just was like a permanent curtain. Yeah. Um, let me know, everyone, if the uh, audio is fine, because, as, as usual, um, the mics are slightly out of sync. Um, but um, hopefully it's fine. Yeah. Right, um, do you want to tell everyone what's going on? Well, what you've been busy... Last week, I can't remember, I think our favourite Man U fan said you had a haircut. I did have a haircut. Because? Because I was going to film in a train station that may have been called St Pancras. Yeah, so basically I was filming for a uh, French... TV show, um, which probably comes out in about a week and a half. I think it's in a week. So anyone who's in France, um, actually, I don't know. I mean, you're global in terms of live chat people. So if anyone is in France, apparently there is a Sunday program called 66 Minutes, which is similar to the US CBS program, 60 Minutes. And they're doing a film, a documentary or a section about St. Pancras. And they wanted someone to play the piano. And obviously, they had a look and they thought, oh, there's someone called Cole. And, and they kind of uh, mm. randomly, very in a very short time, contacted me, or well, contacted Cole, Cole sent him to me, and then we um, got him down there. Yeah. Yeah, so that'll be fun. So if you guys are in France, or any of you are in France, I think it's next Sunday, um, let us know if it's any good, because we don't know if we can see it. Mm. Um, the other one, you could talk about, I think, for Thursday. Royal Festival Hall. Oh yeah, I went to the Royal Festival Hall to watch a concert. Um, where... Uh, I don't know how much you can talk about it, so talk about as much as you think you're allowed to talk about. Yeah, so I think I told patrons about going up to film a documentary in Glasgow, uh, where I was like filming me performing in a piano. Like the no, piano. no, you weren't performing in a piano. Sorry, no. <laughs> That's <laughs> what you just said. In the Glasgow train station. Uh, to play piano there um, and so yeah it was so supposedly it was a documentary so no it's turned into like a series <laughs> but it's not meant to, but in reality it's not a documentary yeah it's like a series because it's like because it ended up when I went to the Royal Festival Hall I saw like all the other pianists there and there was and I realised they'd gone to like four different places and there were like 80 pianists there. So it's turned out there's this, it's going to be like a big series. So it's probably like an episode for each, for each, each station or something. Um, but you know, we went to the Royal Festival Hall. Maybe it's probably like a finale thing for, for the series to watch a concert. So it was going to be, I'll be out in a long time away from now. Yeah, somewhere in the UK, I think. Um... If you're I in the UK, that's probably in as the much detail as I'm allowed to give. I don't think I can give it anymore. Yeah. We, we can talk about it when it airs, because it wasn't quite what we were told. But hey, that's that's part of the fun. So last week, or whatever it was the week before, 
two TV slots, which was really interesting. Um, obviously, if we can do anything, if we can uh, record it, post it, stick it up um, somewhere, we will do so. Yeah. Anyway, I was going to say, um, people are going to get bored about hearing us talk, or me talk anyway. Do you want to do something? I know you've played for 20 minutes. Uh, um, sure. Um, actually, you should say hi um, to all the patrons and all the regulars. Bob's here, uh, George and Gavin's here. I think it was George who's had um, a back operation, so well, um, hopefully hope, he, hope he it gets, goes well. Um, yes, and good recovery, Don. Um, and many of their regulars, um, Sizer, um, I think Rob's trapped in a second or so earlier. I know, in fact, I know it was because they're having problems um, with his YouTube, but uh, I'll say hi to the others uh, in a few moments. Yes, so hello to all of you. I hope you've enjoyed the live stream so far. Um, sounds like it's already been half an hour and I haven't even performed my first piece yet. So I think we should get moving. Okay, go for it. Yeah, so um, I don't know which one I should do first, but you're going to just say it's up to you. So Very um, good. For those that, that uh, have seen us in um, St Pancras, that is almost always what I have to tell Cole when he looks at me, says, what do I do next? George, Gavin and Bob, who tends to be there, um, will know. Mm. So, um, the first piece I'm going to be playing is one by Tom O'Dell. It's called Another Love. I think maybe you might have seen the video that I did with Isabel in Camberley. Uh, where we did like a forehand another love where I kind of joined in to what she was playing. Um, it was a kind of a follow up. Well, not really a follow up. It was on the same day that when I found her at, when we did You Are the Reason. Um, we just happened to do that together. And we we thought it'd be a fun idea to do that kind of same video, except we'd already met each other um, with another love. So yeah, um, that's that kind of story. Story of that YouTube video. So go watch it if you haven't. And go watch it if you have, because it, it's quite cool. Yeah, um, and then all of you can say it's fake again, <laughs> which, which is funny. But uh, yes, that, that's why there were mics everywhere, because um, Isabel's very good. Mm. And I wasn't there anyway. Mummy was there. Yeah, mum was filming. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, um, I guess I'll get to it. Yes, this another is love. another love. You can't tell, but um, Tom O'Dell was looking at the top of your head, checking to see if you can play. Oh, no, you can see... Actually, your, what I do remember is actually Tom Adele went to St Pancras not that long Oh, yes, ago. he was there, uh, I think, about a couple of weeks ago or something. Yeah, same, he went to St Pancras to play Another Love, I think it was. Um, and, yeah, St Pancras... He, Twitter or something posted about it. So, it's pretty cool. But, yes, this is Another Love. And Tom Adele's watching your fingers, just mm. to let you know. Is it a good idea to move this over here? I don't know. Yes, it would be before things fall over. Okay. okay. Take two.
So that was Another Love by Tom Adele. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. Cool, very good. Um, you need to say thank you to Dexter Dodalo. I think it's De hmm? De Oh, he's my, uh, Dexter, Dexter, he's my friend from Perso. Is it? Yeah. Oh, sorry, not is it. Is he? Well, yeah. Uh, well, you have to say thank you to him. because Thanks for the super chat, Dexter. Uh, you can buy him a, um, a milky bar as a thank you. Okay, well, yeah, thanks. So, so how do you say his last name? Is it Dodalo or that? What's the I've never, inflection? I've never thought about it, actually. Do you just all only call him Dexter? <laughs> or Dex? Uh, actually, what's his nickname? Tell the world. No, I just, we, I, normally I call him Dexter. All right. Fair I don't call him anything That's else. quite a boring um, um, uh, mm. nickname. No, it's cool. No, it's very nice. Um, one of the th um, mics was peaking for some reason. At least it was peaking on my side. Mm. Yeah. Um, from what I could tell. Oh, um, okay. Fair he's enough. a Liverpool fan. Just like Becker. Yes. Oh, yes. yes. We have not taken the opportunity opportunity to say we are top of the league. <laughs> yes. <laughs> to yeah, we are top of the league and we'll be to top of the league for the, at next, least till, for the next month and six Well, days. at least till Christmas and potentially through to the new year. Because well, even, if we, even if we lose, we'll still be three points clear. But that we play two games before oh, the new that's, year. That's not good. It's probably like West Ham and Brighton, I think. Both, both are quite tricky. Yeah. And there's a big assumption that any, any of uh, our players will come back um, not dead. Uh, let's um, hope they don't die. Yeah, which would be good. Isn't it? But no, fantastic. That, that sounds really nice. Um, actually, um, you can... Uh, there was a question from one of your patrons. Mm. I can't see you or so you kind of scroll off the page. But you can tell them what you... you um, well, we were intending to just go a quick flyby and a bit of shopping at Battersea. So the question was, and I can't see where it was, but I can remember what it was. Are you going to do any forehands with Patchaban any time soon? Uh, no, but yes. Because I did yesterday. Um, so... <coughs> So yeah, we were we were planning to go shop a bit of shopping, a bit of exploring, and this was at um, Battersea Power Station, which is and quite cool. It's kind of, we kind of went there for the piano, but also just kind of cool just to go shopping as well. Um, and in the end, did we do any shopping? Well, actually, that's not true. I had to do some. You shopping did shopping. I, I had to run around for our USB yeah. cable. Nah, so because it was X out weekend for school, so Patchman asked me to you know come over, maybe play a bit with him, because. Uh, you know, he, he comes out to public pianos as well. Um, so I went out um, and yeah, when we arrived, there was this like little boy playing Bohemian Rhapsody. Uh, so we walked Yeah, around. he was amazing. Yeah. You're rubbish. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> no, so we walked around for a bit, we came back and then we found uh, Jared and, I um, can't remember the other guy. The other Theo. Guy? Theo. Yes. I'm just gonna, I noted his name down and his Instagram. Yes, Theo. Yeah, and there was another guy as well. Well, he wasn't, he came later. Sorry, yeah, no, Theo. Um, I don't want to forget. Um, so yeah, I think Jared and Theo were playing and then I had uh, like a boogie, so I kind of joined in on the top. So I thought, you know, it'd be fun, wouldn't it? Um, so yeah, I didn't realize they were going to be there. And then it ended up that- uh, The whole world. The whole world showed up. So Callum, I th came there. If I can find a way of putting something on the screen without breaking everything, I'll do that. Yeah, so I can't remember it. Well, I have to remember it. Ev everyone can. Callum went there. Uh, right. Melissa right. went there. Enkai went there. Um, right, so you can't see it, but everyone else can see one massive photo that's been put on the screen. Yeah. Uh, Camden went there. Kareem went there. Uh, well, if you. if it, There's something like a 10 second delay before it appears on the yeah. screen. I think so that's a photo actually, of Melissa of has <laughs> somewhere on her. It's also on the screen. Yeah, no, I'm just to remember all the names. Tim, but, Timmy Keys and Alex Riddle. Yeah. Oh, the other people that showed but up. As I was joking yesterday, the world's going to explode because that's probably the greatest concentration of London pianists in one space at one time. And there was all, actually, not in that picture, it was also George. So I don't think we'd... I'd, I've never met... George before I don't think many of the others did but it was quite nice meeting him as well um, and he, I think he played quite a bit of Coldplay tunes um, on that day I think he played well, I can't remember exactly he definitely I don't remember him playing Viva La Vida yeah like you haven't really played any Coldplay ones I apart played from Clocks I played Clocks and that's about it I and think. you did one with Chainsmokers 
Uh, oh yeah, What's something just like this. Yeah. So that was really good. Good. Um, that was. Um, it was quite fun because it was only meant to be a quick flyby and play a bit. Me and uh, Badgerman, and then and it ended up being like, like about four ten... or five hours. Yeah, there was well, about, not five hours. There was about ten at least pianista. So that was quite impressive. So Karim was there. Um, as well as two of them other... were singers, right? So Camden sings and Enkai sings. So it was really good fun. Yeah. Got um, quite a few videos from there, uh, which will keep me busy. Mm. But yeah, um, uh, we'll see how long it is before Dr. K breaks the piano. <laughs> <laughs> With the uh, incessant boogie woogie. No, I think it went part there. of the fun. He He's went, been there before. He went there before. He did a live stream. You know, I was quite surprised. Um, I was quite surprised. I think I was talking to Melissa. Because the internet was quite awful, unless you got the Wi-Fi, which was almost impossible to join. Because um, with the email thing, because it's some reason it didn't work, unlike in other places. Like, I ha but you know, um, so it was it was quite interesting how we managed to actually get a live stream. Because of the yeah, I think if you can get, get well, I managed to join join the Wi-Fi, but I don't know how fast it is. It was good enough just to check get WhatsApp messages oh. from mummy as you were trying it. to send me a couple of things and i didn't get anything until we left yeah until everything until kind of we got to up. like waterloo it's really back. irritating this live chat i've just seen that it kind of um stays on and then suddenly zooms the million messages off the top of the screen <laughs> um but um so cool um so that was fun loads of videos for me to to, to put on um including that what well, amazing boy um, playing Bohemian Rhapsody, yeah. and you did a joint duet with. Oh yeah, I played a duet with him afterwards. Because I, after I played that thing, uh, I asked if he. Well, I mean, you prompted to him that he, we should come and play something together. Yeah, because he was sitting at the back, and it, like, like. Yeah, I didn't watching realize. you guys. And yeah, I didn't realize. He's, he's amazing. Yeah. yeah, I didn't realize he was there, so I didn't, you, you managed to spot him actually. Yeah. So then I was. So he came up. I was like, "Ah, oh, what do you want to play?" And he just starts playing Bohemian Rhapsody. Yeah. And, like, and what's okay. amazing, I, I know you can adapt, but a ten-year-old boy adapting to yeah. you and kind of leaving space for you to play and so on um, was was pretty amazing. Yeah, no, that was that was great as well. He's, that uh, he could do very that talented. Do that, so. um, but as I said, I'll, um, I'll, there's for those that want to know about some of the details behind it. There's two hundred and fifty, probably no, two hundred and seventy gigabytes. Of video and audio from yesterday that I have to go through. That's how much data I have to go through just to keep Cole's channel alive. <laughs> and he doesn't even make a drink for me. I had to make my own drink just now. Oh, I made a drink for you this morning. Though. I know you did, but that's not the point. I gave you too I'm much gonna, milk. I'm going to ignore that one. I gave you too much milk this morning. So yes. You, you need to learn how to make a milk tea properly. Anyway, <laughs> um, people are going to be bored of us talking. Okay, well, let's do the next piece then, which is. I don't know, what is it? Take on me, but Ooh. aha, isn't it? Okay. So, yeah. To be honest, I because I think I'd been saying I was going to be doing this one for a while, um, and I'd actually only I because I knew the song really well. I really loved it, um, probably longer than most other songs. Probably heard it like first time when I was like seven, uh, when I'd only started get starting listening to mainstream music rather than nursery rhymes. Um, it's actually quite interesting on that topic that one of the first songs I'd ever listened to was um, a Queen song called The Show Must Go On. I don't know if you've heard of it. Uh, <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, no, um, because I remember doing it from my acting class and we had to like act The Show Must Go On, which was pretty cool. Um, no, I was just going to point that out. Um, but no, um, I think there was also some like meme from a while ago because... Um, my f me and some of my friends played Minecraft, and there was this like other like child who would scream into his a uh, mic singing um, parodies using famous songs. So take on me. Um, there was like this one that had where they he would sing in the chorus instead of take on me, he would sing Mine Diamonds, which is pretty cool. Um, so it's like a little Minecraft thing. But yeah. Uh, all that is completely meaningless. To it you. is all meaningless to you. I just thought I'd say it. I know about Minecraft. I don't know what mine diamonds are. Oh, you can listen to it later. You'll probably you'll probably hurt your ears though. Thank you. <laughs> um, but yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna stop waffling. This is take on me.
that was Take On Me by Aha. I hope you enjoyed that. Is it Aha? Aha or Aha? I actually don't know. I think it's Aha. Oh, never mind. Oh, whoops. Aha is <laughs> Alan Partridge. But you probably don't know Alan Partridge. Um, it's a comedian or a comedy show. Okay. Well, comedy character um, from a while ago. Mm-hmm. Um, I can't remember his name. Um, but uh, no. Anyway, no, very good. Um, I need to get rid of your background because it's still got the uh, thing. I need to find a way of recording you and somehow convert you to black and white. Um, okay. Gamaster, who is another um, pianist on YouTube, did a uh, cover of that and she's brilliant as well. Um, and she had a whole background. Um, Somehow black and white, actually properly but black and white, right. which is yeah, you've seen it. Black, you? black and white. Yeah. Oh yeah. But yeah, true. Um, but no, I'm not painting our house I'm black and white paint. just no, oh, for, for you, you to no. do that. <laughs> It'd be quite um, the effort. Yeah. Of, and then quite the repaint. Yes. No, which is why the green screen is quite cool. Um, now that it's a proper one, it's actually. I need to find a way. When it's done properly on the video, I can kind of cut out the piano. But on here, on the live stream, because I can't edit it, it's kind of live, the, the green reflection on the piano means that it gets on the piano and also the bit that's kind of underneath the piano where it's slightly um, not quite completely green mm-hmm. um, is there too. But anyway, that was me just uh, waffling about the green screen. But uh, no, that was very nice. Um, so apart from, I know Destiny's not here. I'm hoping, hoping Destiny's um, good. What is it, slouching? Yes, because um, I know some of the Del- Destiny sometimes has health issues. So hopefully um, that'll be good. Um, she is okay. But obviously hi to the uh, patrons as well. There's many, many, many patrons on here today. Um, I've not seen Ari, but it's quite late for Ari um, because I don't think her clock has changed yet. So, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. Do you want to do some requests? Okay. Otherwise, you'll just hear me waffling again. Let's do some requests. Yeah. If I get on a topic of social media things like that, um, you're climbing quite rapidly towards nine hundred thousand. Great. And then after nine hundred thousand comes a million, isn't it? Yes. But get to nine hundred thousand first. True. And we all get. Um, that chat chatbot has. Um, Wouldn't it be has... really cool if I got a million subscribers? Though? It would be good. Okay, let's get up. Right, I am going to somehow fix the chatbot whilst you're looking at that. Um, I mean, I'm not looking at anything, I'm just. I know you're not looking at anything yet, but I am going to have to turn off the chatbot and turn it back on and see if it fixes it. Um, it probably doesn't because it's broken. You ready? Um, the first one you don't have to listen to. Oh, never mind. Um, I say you don't have to listen to it because I think you've done it before as a play by ear. And I'm pretty positive you would have done something about this at school. I might have forgotten about it. But what is it? It's the X Factor bit where it goes crazy. Carmina Burana? Uh, Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You're looking at me muting it because I know it's going to get loud. <laughs> Yes, it was. Um, actually, I think that would be amazing in um, in the public piano because I'm not sure many people would would have played that um, out in public. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen anyone play that out anywhere, let alone in public. Probably is it's um, popular. Yeah, I'm, I'm, as in, I'm sure it must be played elsewhere um, in other ways, but I haven't 
I don't think I've actually heard that played on a piano. Right, let's do something that... Um, I don't know. You don't know. Um, I am going to bring you back to It's Coming Home at some point, um, because World Cup time. Mm. Um, Merlin X, who used to um, follow you um, in School Rock Times, um, has said he went to see the Osmonds musical yesterday. Osmonds being the band uh, from ages ago. Can you play Crazy Horses? Apparently. Crazy Horses. I recognise the name, but I don't recognise... I recognise Crazy and Horses. Very good. But I don't recognise Crazy Horses. Very good. Uh... Oh, Nicholas has asked for maybe an older World Cup song. Ness and Dorma. Well, I'm going to do Crazy Horses. I know. No, I'm just saying Ness and Dorma. That's um, a very interesting first sound. That'll be... It's well, I'm not going to play the piano for that. Making a note of it. I think Ness and Dorma into coming home. So I'm just making notes. Actually, maybe I do this bit. It's okay. gonna just. So for those that don't know, Cole is losing his ear. He's doing a play by ear. He cannot. We cannot play out loud. Um, oh, this is the chorus, definitely. Oh, Bob Postmaster says Crazy White Horse. This is challenging. I'm not even sure which one it is. I don't even know either of these. You've got Crazy Horses, presumably. Yeah. Uh, the chorus part, or wherever. Yeah. Okay. listen to the music of the Osmonds. Mm. Oh, actually, I probably have done without realising. I mean, they were absolutely massive um, previously, I'm sure. Glenn Quagmire says, oh, I think I remember this song. So I assume, Great. It, was, I assume it was reasonably accurate then. Um, well, it's fine. Right, OK. So, World Cup time. Oh. It's coming home into Ness and Dorma. Coming back into it, it's coming home. I was playing the wrong thing. Were well, you playing the wrong key and the wrong notes?
There you are. Very good. The reason I'm pausing is I think the live chat bot has finally just keeled over because <laughs> it is just completely anymore. frozen. I'm going to have to find a way of just... Um, oh, I want to see it. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Mm. Uh, I wonder why it's doing that. I am just going to delete it. Oh, it has stopped. I know, which is particularly irritating, so I'm just going to delete it. As in, not even hide it. It's gone. Hmm. Um, you know, I wonder what the... Actually, hmm? speaking of the Rocket, what was the score? 2-0. Oh, did the you end 2-0? Yes. Well, you can't see it, because if, if it hadn't frozen, you will see it kind of scroll off the top of the screen. But it, in, I can see... Because I've got the actual chat chat on the side, so I actually can see... Um, that. You know what that means, Daddy. Uh, what does it mean? It means points for me. Have you got a fantasy <laughs> World Cup league? Yeah. Apparently, there was there was an accusation that uh, Qatar had tried to bribe, or someone in, in Qatar on behalf of Qatar was trying to bribe uh, Ecuador to um, to I don't know, to lose. I'm guessing not to win, just two nil. Um, well, but, but more it, points for me, as in I get it a, didn't work. As in, I have the Ecuadorian goalkeeper in my team. Okay. Isn't that cool? <laughs> well, yes, because they... Well, I suppose they was always going to score... Well, not always. <clears throat> it was unlikely for them to score any goals. Right. Um, let's do something from... I don't know. Let's do a couple of classical ones. Um, you're requested, but I can't. Oh, Swiffy likes Skittles. Beethoven for Lees, and I like a bit of Claire de Lune. <laughs> you just want Claire Lynn. Yes, okay. I just want Claire Lynn. I, I have okay. um, um, dad privileges. Um, obviously, I know others like it. Bob likes it as well. And, uh, True, and so but, but uh, I like Claire de Lune. Yes, therefore, you must play You Claire must. <laughs> yes. Okay, right. I'll do it anyway. Yes, it very It's a good. nice song, tune, piece. Yeah. Yeah, piece. It's not piece. a song. Song is a singing thing. Or two-set violin will come and smack you. Now, Speaking of the two-set violin and Brett, who has a perfect pitch, you had your perfect pitch test yesterday. Yeah. For quite a bit. That will be a video coming out soon. Check it out when it comes out. Yeah, which is really interesting. Where um, two or three pianists were still testing your uh, perfect pitch. Mm. Look out for that when I eventually get off my butt and do that. Anyway. That'd be a cool video, actually. I think it will be. You're about to make ages there, is it, though? But, um, well, actually, maybe I'll just slap the whole video out and just not bother editing it. It might be easier. And then otherwise people I think just say it's pretty it's cool if you edited it, though. Thank you. <laughs> you well, maybe I edit it. Yes, even better. Well, I want to try it as that video, actually. That'd be cool. Yes. I want to edit it. Do it, well, after your exams and... I don't Maybe you like during Christmas. Christmas. Not yeah, during, during the Christmas, Christmas That's break. That's a bit long. Actually, maybe you should edit it then. Okay. Anyway, get with it. Out, Stop cool stalling. Video. Claire de Lune, Furleys, in whichever order you want, as well as River Flows in You, because that's pseudo classical. Because I like it too. No, because someone did ask for it. Go oh, for okay. it. <laughs> actually it was apparently well, there is a uh, level five piece. insane version of Ver Elise by music base musical basic that's a very that username is very familiar I think I've seen him his stuff before hmm. uh, but yeah 
Um, right, a couple more maybe uh, before I can smell chicken wings. Well, I can smell chicken wings. I know there's chicken wings. Um, because mum said I was going to 100% be chicken wings this time. I know. And not a scam. Which makes it, <laughs> I'm joking. Which um, makes it even more fun. Mm. Um, it's not chicken wings because it could be anything. It's chicken wings because it actually is chicken wings today. Yes. Um, with rice, that's what I want. I'm hungry now. The one thing you've made me want. hungry too. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, you've got a jazz concert tomorrow. Oh, what do. are you doing? Um, I've got a couple of Herbie Hancock tunes that we're going to be playing in the improv group. So that's a small group of people. And then in the big band, I've also got one tune because all the pianists have one because there's three pianists. Yeah. Um, and so that one I'm going to play is called "This Is How It's Gonna Be." Yeah, for those that know, don't know or don't follow you enough to know, you go to music school, so um, yeah, you, you so, study jazz, mm. well, as well as composition and so on. Yeah, of. it's interesting, there's three jazz pianists. There was two year. last year, was that? It's two last year. Well, I say two, but um, Angelica kind of is a jazz pianist, but she's now, she wasn't in the big band last year, but now she is this year. Oh, and George cool. has also, in year 13 now, has switched over to jazz piano. Yeah. Um, which is interesting. So now there's now three jazz pianists in big band. Cool. The more the merrier. Right, let's uh, pick uh, one more that is a play by ear, and then maybe we'll finish with something that isn't a play by ear. Okay. And I am going to scroll up, and where are we? Um, something by the, the weekend. Something by the weekend. Or the weekend. Weekend. Save your tears. Save your tears. Actually, I think I know that bit. Do you? Okay. Well, I know the chorus, so there you are. It sounds familiar, so it sounds like you must have got it right. Um, okay. If you were going to play your favourite one that isn't Queen, because I know you just keep playing Queen, 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 which you could do, but not Bohemian Rhapsody, um, what would it be? Anything. Yes. This is one I haven't played. Well, it's not, my, it's not necessarily my favourite one, but it's kind of cool because it's related to the World Cup. Okay. You might have heard of um, a nice cool clip about Cristiano Ronaldo. Um, there's a there's a YouTube streamer called Icho Speed that went Christo Ronaldo Sui, um, which kind of made him popular. And now he has over 10 million subscribers, um, and he released a song called World Cup. So I could play the chorus of that. Okay, Good and obviously uh, we, our really favorite nice. Man U fan who's still here really loves. I'm guessing, maybe not really loves Cristiano Ronaldo anymore because of his insaneness. But anyway, right? What's it called? Oh, yeah, he did. Oh, it's called. It's literally just called World Cup. Yeah. Is this chorus is quite nice because actually um, because what I like about the chorus um, is that um, not only like the tempo is like a lot more laid back in the chorus than it is in the verses but in the chorus it has like this cool songwriter technique where they just repeat the words World Cup the whole time is that um, a songwriter Rep technique World yeah, Cup World Cup World Cup World Cup World Cup World Cup like that yeah well not <laughs> well kind of but do you want to listen to it <laughs> yeah go on Apparently he's got 30 million now, according to our favourite Man U fan. Mm. Go. So did that bit go World Cup, World Cup, World Cup, World Cup, World Cup, World Cup? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Maybe I do need to listen to it. Um, I do remember, I, I recognise that, presumably because you must have been playing it at home, or clearly, obviously, at home, but, but you also, must have been playing actually, it. Actually, another interesting thing about it is that actually it's got the same chord progression as Interstellar. Is it? Okay. Now you're going to have to explain. I'll play Interstellar for you. Yes, well, I know, but you've got to explain. So, so actually, 
if I play the chords, so the chords are the chords are F, G, A, and I think it's like a G with a B bass, so that's the first inversion. In Interstellar, it's exactly the same. And what was the other guys? So, so that's that. So I show speed is the new Hans Zimmer. <laughs> is that what you're saying? No, no. It's many, many songs use same chord progressions. It's just maybe that's my, where you might recognise it. So what is a chord progression? Because clearly I hit, I recognised, well not recognised, I heard the, the chord part where you went bang. Chord progression is a progression of chords. Thank you. So but like, Interstellar wasn't a progression of chords. You, you had one bit and then you just hit a note. Oh, is that what a chord progression is? Yeah. Okay. There's loads of chords after each other. Okay. I'm never going to understand, so there's no point in explaining it to me. But, uh, no, okay, fair enough. Um... I'm yeah. trying to think. I'm looking at the list. Dead air now. Yeah, I know. I'm looking at the list. I'm trying to think. Can I fit in one more before I go ravage some uh, chicken wings? Um, yes, I think we can. Great. Um, so what is it? It was. Where is it gone? It went off the list. Went oh, there it is. A bit. Uh, yes, right at the very top. A bit of children. Okay. And so then take this off because it's quite annoying. Yes. And then I can go eat whilst you can play seven minutes of children. What? No, I'm joking. Just play a bit of children. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video so far and also just in general um, if you did please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already uh, and yeah um, go check out my merch my <laughs> patreon yes uh, music notes and all that oh yeah breath mm. fantastic right thank you everybody um, apologies for the issues with the chat bot I don't know what's going on I wonder if it's fixed Oh, I don't think it will. <sighs> I think it's going up and down and it's going to go at some point. Right, so you need to go back to school after I've eaten some chicken wings. I'm and guessing me. You, you want to eat some chicken wings I too. would like to eat some chicken wings too, please. Yes, you can. So fantastic. Hopefully um, everything will stay up and running. I need to fix this silly microphone. Well, actually, mm. this roadcaster thing, which seems to um, not want to work properly. Um, but fantastic. Thank you. Uh, thank you for all the support. Uh, thank you for coming up. Thank you for all the chats on here it's brilliant and and i can just see the chat but also not working it just went streaming up again so fantastic see you guys next time okay goodbye everyone <laughs>